my queen, said the royal sorcerer to Hatshepsut, with this amulet, you and your descendants are endowed by the goddess Isis with the powers of the animals and the elements. You will soar as the falcon soars, run with the speed of gazelles, and command the elements of sky and earth. 3,000 years later, a young science teacher dug up this lost treasure and found she was heir to the secrets of Isis. And so, unknown to even her closest friends, Rick Mason and Rennie Carroll, she became a dual person. Andrea Thomas, teacher. Oh, mighty Isis. And Isis, dedicated foe of evil, defender of the weak, champion of truth and justice. Dr. Blanchard, how's Noah this morning? He's been looking forward to this day since the accident. He's inside with Rennie. I hope you've told him that this operation isn't always successful. I told him, Dr. Blanchard, as to whether he understands it. I used to ride in horse shows a lot. Oh, they're beautiful. Noah, Dr. Blanford's here. Hello, Noah. Let's get to those bandages, hmm? you see? Nothing. That's a light in. I can feel the light on my face, but I can't see a thing. I guess I can't go riding anymore. No, your sight can come back. Maybe within a few months. Or maybe never. Noah, sightless people have become lawyers and doctors. Isn't that right? Oh, absolutely. And, and judges and, and psychiatrists and research workers. You can be a great scientist. You can be anything you want. But it means hard work. I'll be back tomorrow. We'll work it out together. slow now. Looks like Noah's feeling better about things. Sure does. Zephyr winds which blow on high, lift me now so I can fly. Be 
So, who are you? People call me Isis. Isis? You sound just like my teacher, Miss Thomas. Is that a fact? You know what you're supposed to do after you're thrown. I'm not getting back on that horse. You've got to meet your fears head on, or they're going to beat you. I can't. Isis. Noah, are you all right? I'm fine. How did you get here? My secret. Rick, will you please walk Noah and the horse back for me? Of course. Noah used to be a fine rider till his accident. I wish we could get him back on that horse. Maybe it's not the right horse for Noah. I know that look. What are you getting at? I know someone who trains horses for the blind. A seeing eye horse? Exactly. Maybe we can borrow one. Beautiful horse. I'll get no. He's got a nice easy walk, now. Make a slow turn to the left. If you should ever drop the reins, he'll stop. And he's trained to avoid streets and stop where there's danger, like at railroad crossings. What if I should fall off and we get separated? Go directly to the fence and call him. Sonny, come here. Suppose I get lost on him. He'll come right back to the crowd. Of course, since he's new here, we'll have to teach him that this is his home now. Come on, Noah. Climb on. Just get in the saddle. Get the feel of him. I can't. We'll let him be for a while.
good old horse. There we go. We're going to put this on you now. You stay here. I'll get you some oats. How to thank you. What you're doing for Noah. Oh, Mrs. Schuster, please. Noah is a fine boy. As for thanking me, well, I'll settle for your apple pie recipe. It's my pleasure. Now, if you'll go find Noah, I'll get the dinner and the pie on the table. On my way. the way home. I'm taking you home. Now, all we gotta do is find that path. I don't see him. We better split up and circle the ranch. We'll meet on the far side. All right.
is it, Sonny? Smoke. It's coming down from the barn. Help me, Sonny. I can't walk. You want me to ride you? I'm afraid. You've got to meet your fears head on, or they're going to beat you. Sonny, where are you? You're down, Sonny. You trying to help me? Okay, let's go, Sonny. Are the horses safe? They're all right in the corral. Now wait here for your mother. You're very brave, Noah. But please, never, never go into a burning building again. Promise me? I promise. And Sonny did all that. He really saved me. You know, he really is a seeing eye horse. And Noah's forgetting to tell you that he rode Sonny all the way back here to give the alarm. And then that rain coming just at the right time. It almost makes you believe in miracles. Or ISIS. <laughs> that should keep your seeing eye horse where he belongs. Sonny getting out was the best thing that ever happened to me. Besides meeting ISIS, that is. <laughs> Looks like Ted has found a friend. <laughs> <laughs>